So today, we are going to be painting, and I'm just going to be saying the little facts over stuff. But, before we get started, let's recap. So, my brother's not here, because I just want to do it to myself. And, we, we both got Instagrams, I said in the last video. Um, mine's Moo, Moo underscore farm life, and his is Crash Core. Crash underscore one corner. So, yeah. Go follow us there. Smash the like button. Make sure you give a big thumbs up. That's the same thing. Okay. Smash the like button. Comment. Today you're going to comment. Hmm. Your favorite type of paint. Like gouache. Acrylic. Watercolor. Tempera. Like, one of those. Um, and make sure you subscribe if you want to. Alright, let's get started. So, I'm going to show you what I'm using today. I'm using this canvas. I'm pretty sure it's the 8x10 canvas. Um, I'm going to be using hand gouache. It's a 44 colors. Can we gouache? And yeah, I'm gonna show you my workspace and how I'm gonna do this. So yeah, let me. Um... I just put it on here so I don't get my stuff. And yeah, one second, I'm just gonna move some of this stuff so I don't have paint on it. Okay. And we're gonna use heavy gloss. So what I'm thinking is doing a black background and then maybe like a galaxy on top. But yeah, let's get started. I'm not using this spray bottle. It's disgusting. It's my paint spray bottle, don't worry. Um and maybe some thunder some respawn in there. Okay, yeah. Don't worry about that. And my paper is. I'm probably using these boots today. Like, 
these hoodies too. These are the yellow ones actually. Here's the gouache. And yeah, let's get started. So here's my biggest brush. This is really disgusting. Um, yeah, I'm gonna use the most one because this is so ugly. Yeah, so this brush, a lot of my brushes are from Hobby Lobby, so I'm gonna open my gouache and then we'll go through my questions. I should not have picked that up. Oh, okay. I'm gonna show you guys that. I don't wanna mix it up and ignore yourself. So let's get painting. Let's soften up. Okay, so. I guess I'm gonna put it in our way. Okay. You started to watch I did. Because how many did you have? One. Huh? Um one. Because I needed it washed. Sorry. What are you doing? Making a video? Okay. So that's what I have so far. A huge gloss on there of black wash. This is not a really good paintbrush to use a different one. This is the biggest one I got. I could be using scotch. I don't want to use a scotch. I need some water in here. Ugh, that got all over me. So we're going to be doing some questions about like painting when I started painting. Yeah. So I started getting into painting when I was like, well, getting into art when I was like, <laughs> I've loved art my whole life. Um, yeah. I was really big into makeup when I was younger and now I'm in painting and drawing. I have over a thousand markers and probably over, no, over 50 tubes of paint. And yeah, my favorite, my two favorite art mediums are paint and, well, acrylic paint and markers. Any markers, I don't really care. Like the worst marker, um, but yeah, I will literally do any. I hate color pencils, like crayon. Sorry, but yeah. I love to paint. The only thing I'm really good drawing at is um, cows little heads of cows and I'm really good at shading pencil shading and in school I do two electives in art visual journaling and painting class they were both just fun classes I didn't really like painting but visual journaling was fun and yeah so I pretty much love drawing anything I could. 
Like, I will literally doodle in math more than do math. But I love math, so. Yeah. I want some of the covers. I work out how to, like, dry. Then come back to that. Totally. I also hold it to get the best angle to see where I'm missing. My favorite type of paint is acrylic. I'm just testing out flash because I just got it from my, um, I think it was Christmas. Christmas or my birthday. Um, and I really like it. It's kind of hard to work with just because you have to get, like, the right medium of water and gouache to get it perfect this is not even close to perfect there's like 50 layers of paint on here i like to hold up to the light to see like the little things i'm missing make sure just to black it out with black so when i start it for the galaxy it'll be completely covered see i like these canvases they're like Probably a lot of canvases. Or canvases to go. Um. Because they're really high quality, I'd say. They're not high quality, but they're super nice to work with. I just like them. And if you're wondering, I don't paint when I do some painting. Did that once in main class. Didn't like it. Um. I'll have to show you guys if it's a big painting class. It was. And the worst paint I've ever done, but yeah, I only have not counting this painting. I've only done two paintings. That was yesterday, so with wash. And yeah, and what home it is. Um, so there's that. This is completely blacked out now, and well, that's drying. I will show you the painting I did in painting class. I'm gonna put this in the tube of water. This is my paint cup. It's disgusting. And I, some new pieces I planted cornfields. So we had this kind of like hideout thing in, a, in the cornfield. And me and my brother went out there. We bought a blanket. We bought some water bottles. Because it gets broken scratchy in there. And we painted. We left one of the water bottles out there. And when I came around with the chopper. The thing that cuts the corn down for harvest. Um, we went to go look. And it was still, the water bottle was still going. So we never wanted to go pick it up. But. Um, but, yeah, I don't think I've ever painted other where, other than the cornfield in my house. That's cool. That's not really weird. Um, but yeah, I want to go paint the hay bales, um, because I really like being there, and I like, I'm gonna probably go paint them, I want to go paint during the spring break, but it's cold. Um... Oh, yeah, I'll show you that painting. Oh. Okay, don't worry, that was just my Chromebook. Can you plug it in? I should have both of them, actually. My mom loves them. My best friend didn't like her, so she gave it to me. And they're the same thing, so I connect them. So, I'll show you my best friend first. This is hers. There's no highlights in the car, that's why she didn't want it. Um, and here's mine. So, how I have them on my wall is like this. Something like that. Actually, I probably should put on like this because that looks a lot better. This guy doesn't, but like the bottom part kind of meets up more. I might put them back like this, but yeah, I like them. They're not supposed to be connected, so if you thought they were, they're not. And actually, like this, this guys don't even match up at all. Like, see that? It would just be like this. They match up way better. 
But yeah, we did use a painting class. It was fun. We did use our flower painting class. So that was fun. But yeah, so I'm gonna put this back on the wall. Then you're gonna paint up. So it should be really like this. No, it should be. Or it should be like this. I guess I'll show you some things I painted. So these are the things I painted with gouache. Like so there's this one with a I used a sponge. It was kind of like a test of like how much water to use. I used too much water. Um and then this is my favorite painting of gouache. But the only one. And I really like it. My two paintings. I really want to repaint this one, but, yeah, I like this one best, not this one, this one's just ugly, it looks cool, but ugly, and then, I have some paintings of acrylic I can show you, I then, oh, that painting back there, oh god, on the wall, right? God, I'm moving the wrong way. Right there? My cousin painted that for me for my birthday. She's an artist like me. So. She's more crafty. I'm more of an artist. We got together great. Um. Yeah. This is so long to dry. I need to show my sponges. Ready? Oh, this is an expand. Oh, there's no sponges in it, but these are my sponges. These ones are not flat. Oh, they're still wet. They're supposed to expand. I don't know why they're not expanding. Um, this sponge I don't really like. The best sponge I have. This one by far. This one and these are the best ones. That one's still soaking wet. Oh my god. Um, the worst one I'd say is this one. This one's bad because I have like little furry things. I don't really like half of my sponges, but I got them at Hobby Lobby and I don't really like half of them. This will keep it all nice. It's probably gonna mold. I really don't want it to mold. Because I don't want them all away. But, yeah. like it shall expand if it wants to um well you know what else to show you um i'm gonna show you this i made at school there's stickers in here please stickers um it's a pig nose because i show pigs i'm actually gonna use next sunday not this, well, not Sunday. Next Sunday. So, yeah. My friend's idea to make this. Because we need to pick a container and Linda make. I don't know what she made, actually. But. Oh, it's a pig nose. The bottom's disgusting. The top of the lid's actually really gross. But, but, yeah. It doesn't fit really well. So come back for part two when this is dry, okay? Dry. See you in part two when this is dry. Peace.